Okay, that's enough of that. Hey, everybody, my name is Forgetting. Today I'm back playing more of Layers of Fear. So, from the last left off, we we're continuing to get more information as to the little girl, this this girl's, why well, I say little girl, this girl's horrible family history. Let's continue. I'm thinking this is like the ending because it's locked. I think it's like the final part. So, I'm pretty much going to continue going through the horrible environment. Uh, I think I've already been through here, so let's go through here. Yeah. Oh, it's her. Oh. Well, oh, here we go. Oh. All right, young lady. Shall we continue? Right. Whatever happens, just keep looking at me and listen. Okay. Now, where was I? Ah, yes. The princess was all alone in the dark. And yet, she felt that the evil witch was lurking nearby. As her eyes adjusted to the darkness... Uh-oh, why is it my head looking? And yet, she... <sighs> and yet, she did not dare to move. For she knew that that would be the end of her. The princess heard a fearsome growl. The witch had unleashed. As the princess moved, the growl got louder. Jesus. The witch had unleashed her familiar. I don't want to look. The, hellhound. the monster sniffed at the air. I don't want to look. His perky ears wary of even the slightest sound. The princess remained motionless, letting the monster pass. There was a stillness in the air. I, uh, why is it forcing me? It's preventing me from... Oh. For a moment, it seemed like the worst was behind her. And yet she knew that it was not over. Oh my god, it's really trying to distract me. I'm gonna look at the painting, I believe. Oh, there's fire. She kept looking straight ahead. Suddenly, she heard a terrifying cackle. It was the evil witch herself. Jesus, this is such a terrible father. Beauty and innocence, for she had neither. The hag was near, just outside of view. But our heroine didn't dare to look. She had to keep her head straight, lest she be cursed by the witch's foul magic. She could almost feel the chilling touch of the witch. Just don't look. What the hell is this? She felt the Just don't look. Urge to run away, but fought it with all her will, for she knew that was precisely what the witch would have wanted. And then, just like that, the chill was gone. She saw a glimmer of light over the horizon. The sun was almost upon her. It was almost dark. Ah, Doberman. Almost I think that's a Doberman dog. There. The princess stood triumphant in the sun, smiling as she... Wait. That's not right. Her face. Why is she still... scared? Oh, God. I didn't mean to... Princess, I am so sorry. Oh boy. It's not that he was cruel. It's just that, to him, reality was just a pale reflection of art. He was blind to the world, unless it was translated to him through a canvas. Oh, hello. Uh oh. What? Okay, that was weird. Okay, what's the other pieces of of the thing that I'm missing? Because, yeah, I'm missing some... Okay, so that's, I think, unlocked, but let me quickly attach these other pieces. Um, eh. Okay, so I'm just missing one. Big question is, what is the last one? 
think I'm getting it. Hold on. Nope. Ah. Nope. Maybe here to there, there to there. I think I'm starting to get a, the right drawings in place. Oh, I think I know what it is. I think I'm starting to... Now, what, where do I get the middle one? Huh, we gotta figure that out. Oh, what's this? Dear friend, today before I leave for my new appointment, I intend to make one final attempt to communicate with you. Since you have obviously decided not to answer my calls or letters, I shall I shall endeavor to speak with you in person. If you're reading this, then I have clearly failed, and for that I apologize. Should you choose to ignore me, I will slip this letter under your door. Hopefully you can at least read it, for old times' sake, if me knocking on the door has caused you any discomfort, please know that that was not my intent. I wish I could tell you that I found some miracle solution to your problem, but unfortunately, such is not the case. Uh, do know that as your legal representative, I always did my best, and that is the God's honest truth. Fortunately, I feel that the issue you're struggling with go way beyond my expertise. At this point, I once again feel the urge to ask you to reconsider seeking professional help. But let me be honest, if you were to listen to me, you would have done it all long time ago. I regret it had to end this way. Know that you are and your family will always be in my thoughts. Your f old friend, James Jerome Sadler, uh, attorney at law. Yikes. Lost that court case with, for the daughter. Oh, boy. Have I been in here before? Oh, yeah, it's the kitchen. Wait a moment. Oh, for a second, I thought there was something on the floor. Okay, I need to figure out when the last piece of the art is, because we're missing one, and it looks like I'm missing the middle. Yeah, I love it when doors close. Okay. Okay, let me see. Jesus Christ. Oh. I missed this. Oh, hello. There's the last drawing. Oh. The rat problem. <coughs> this place is a mess. Yeah, that's your dad for you. Oh, no. Flashback. I can hear you in there. I'm coming, you furry little bastards! You're not getting away this time! Oh, where did I put that damn key? Oh boy. Father of the year. He really went insane at the end. Jesus Christ, that turned dark. Okay, well, let's attach this last piece. I think I've actually put it in the right order, so let me see this now. Me. But what does it mean? Oh, there has to be more to this. Huh. Interesting. So it's just one big old photo of her uh, or drawing of her. That's interesting. Maybe at the very end of the father's uh Life, he regretted all the horrible things he did to his wife and his daughter. I think I've already read this, I think. But yeah, interesting. Okay, well, let's go to the last thing. I'm scared what it's gonna be. Oh, apparently, wait a moment, there's, a, there's an achievement. Wait a moment. I was quickly looking. They're, they're saying that I should use the flashlight. And then... Turn it off for 30 seconds. Oh, 
Oh. What is this? Oh, I should have known. It's all just a sick joke. Oh, okay. It was a luminous paint. Interesting. That is weird. So it's... Huh. I think either I did it wrong, because apparently this is supposed to be a good ending, but it's not working. Let's see, will the map actually, like, trigger if I even... Hold on, I'm curious. You know what, maybe I have to do the one of the uh, first endings so that I can then do the final ending, maybe. Let me try that, because for some reason, it's bugged. I don't know what the hell's going on. Okay, well, let me go inside here and see what's in... Or Oh, I actually, uh, it lagged for a second. Maybe it's triggered something. Because, yeah, for some reason, this is supposed to be the good ending that I'm doing right now. But apparently, it's not working. Oh. Yeah, reset. No, it didn't. Yeah, it looks like I must have did something wrong. So then I just complete the main ending. And then I guess I'll do, like, a quick speed run. And get like the good ending because I don't know if this then this, the things I'm about to pick are the good ending since the secret is the good ending. Oh boy. I don't know what I expected to find. A farewell note. A final will. What I found was an apology expressed in the only language he ever truly knew. At that moment, I could finally see my father for what he was. A man driven insane with sadness and guilt. Trapped in this house, a nightmarish echo chamber of past mistakes and tragedies. It was this house, a place beyond hope, beyond redemption. I knew what I had to do. Oh, so she just does arson. I had given up trying to understand my father a long time ago. Jesus, uh, I think you should leave. That doesn't look safe, lady. No, baby face. And you will burn in hell for what you have done to me. Goodbye, baby face. Well. Oh. oh, is this supposed to be in the 70s? Because it's like some really hey, interesting. What have you got there? Oh, that's so lovely, sweetie. Why pink? Oh no. The family and Sandy's coming back. Also, I love how on the on the desk there was medication. Schizophrenia. Schizophrenia, my god. Why pink? Okay. Then they restart inheritance. They restart inheritance. Let me actually do the good ending. Okay. I did a little bit of some stuff. I did an, another playthrough, crossed my fingers that I have done it. Nope. I'm hoping I've done it. Nope. Nope. There we go. Is that it? No, I think that's supposed to go there. It's... it's me. But what does it mean? I guess now I have to wait for to 30 seconds. I hope I've done it completely. Apparently, I was supposed to be, like, really in the favor of the father more than anything. 
Um, the only thing I screwed up was the stupid looking at the painting while he paints the daughter thing, because that sucks because of that whole head bobbing where it's like, uh, 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 it's hard to like really like force it down. Like, I hate that. Okay. Now yeah, let me see. Cross my fingers. What is this supposed to? Yes, I did it. The lines are. Yes. Now, now I see it. Like you knew I would. Okay. So it's right over here. I had to dig deep to uncover what my father really wanted me to find. In the process, I realized what he was trying to tell me. This house was nothing but a tomb. There was nothing left for me here. No answers. No solace. No closure. My true inheritance lay within. And then, just like that, it finally happened. For the first time in my life, I saw the world through my father's eyes. Oh. I was once told that insanity runs in my family. Let it run. That is not the good ending. No. No. Oh my god, that was not a good ending. Oh, God, it's just a cursed family. Jesus Christ. No, I thought it was going to be a good end, an actual good ending. No, that's so bad. That was so bad. That was completely the opposite of what I was thought it was going to be. God damn. Well, that's inheritance for you. Oh boy. Well, it just goes to show you this game is a cautionary tale of one's pride, arrogance, ego, um, treating others the way you want to be treated, and also the, the cautionary tales of mental health and mental illness. Because I think the father must have suffered from schizophrenia, which it looks like the daughter had, had passed down to her because she wants to go insane like her father and in that one uh ending with the white pink thing um i saw the medication tablets on the uh desk or the coffee table um so yeah it looks like they suffer from schizophrenia which affects them in a terrible way and it affected her childhood and and she's gonna affect her daughter as well it's sad, but it is what it is. But yeah, it's a it is a family curse. It looks like it is a family curse. Oh boy, uh, this was a very good, interesting horror game. I really like the whole multi like multiple choice path with different alternate endings type system. I really do like that. Um, I also really did like the music like for some reason that ending that beginning music is so good like this this end this beginning music I freaking love it. I freaking love it. It was great. But yeah, this was layers of fear uh, I'll probably play the second game later on. I want to do some other series, but yeah, so this has been layers of fear I have to end it here Didn't want to rhyme that God damn, what is with my most recent videos? I've been rhyming video of like a lot of things. Okay. This has been Layers of Fear. I have to end it here. Um New series coming soon, my dears. See ya!